You're watching EAC News. Thank you for joining us. At the invitation of the King of Saudi Arabia, Cambodian Prime Minister Hun Manet led a high-level delegation to the inaugural ASEAN Gulf Cooperation Council Summit in Riyadh on Friday. While there, he was able to connect with the Saudi King, a Saudi CEO, and the Vietnamese Prime Minister. EAC News reporter Anthony Ellis has the details. According to the press release from the Ministry of Foreign Affairs on the conference, Prime Minister Hulmanet emphasised the importance role of trade and investment in fostering economic growth and sustainability. He highlighted the crucial need to further support free and open trade, stimulate investment and create a conductive environment for the promoting business in the two regions in line with the economic trends of the 21st century and in response to global uncertainties. He urged the GCC and the Asian leaders to explore new sources of growth in key areas such as conservativity, digital economy, green energy transaction, banking and finance, regional supply chains and artificial intelligence. In the face of the food insecurity growth with climate change, he urged the GCC members to explore the possibility for further agricultural investment in addition to exchanging technologies, research and best practices, especially in developing the halal food industry. The Cambodian Prime Minister also expressed concern and regret over the escalating violence in the Middle East, saying that GCC members are in a unique position to broker a peaceful solution to the violence, which has already taken the life of the Cambodian veterinary student. He emphasised the need to provide full access to humanitarian aid and for the people of Gaza, half which are children. He also called for the immediate release of the Hamas hostages. The leaders agreed to continue the conference on a biannual basis, with the next one being held in Malaysia 2025. The Prime Minister also met with Saudi Arabia's king to discuss building stronger ties between the two countries in trade, investment and energy. They agree that the Saudi embassy will be open in Cambodia, complete with visa exemptions for diplomats and officials. Anthony Ellis, EAC News.